Whoa. I missed the recording. So we're at the jumps. We got Matt up at the start gate. I'm gonna take this cute little thing and record whatever sounds his bike is making. And then I'm gonna turn it into a song. session for a little bit. Uh oh. So these are the sounds that we have, just 228 to 236 here. I haven't really listened to them. I know there's a lot of wind noise in them, so I might just run them through an effects channel and high pass them like super hard. The song's going to be an A minor because it's going to turn into a remix that I'm doing for somebody, but I can't finish it during this stream because one, I probably don't have the time and two, he hasn't sent me the stems yet. All right. We're just going to take this little bit here. Actually, let's just hear what it sounds like right now. Maybe we can like clone that and reverse it. Yeah, there we go. But this is going to get like way, way more complex. That, that sounds super sick. I'm just going to copy that as it is copy everything that's in the piano roll because for some reason that doesn't copy. Also, all the battle scars on my face are not because I suck at shaving. I crashed when I was filming for my new music video up at the jumps. Holy shit, you good? And we're doing this in A minor. But my problem is, I don't know what A is. Hold up, I've got a guitar here. So that's A. So I wanna... Switch this to an A. Bring that up a bit. Okay, so now A is an A. I'm gonna leave that on effects zero for now so that I can, oh no, wait, effects two, cause then it can peak. Cause like, I don't want this to be in the foreground. I kind of want it to just be like a back background melody. There we go. Maybe like back here. I'm gonna add a bunch of reverb to it. We're gonna go with the calf compressor just cause it's the easiest one to use. There we go. And I think I'm gonna change this up a little bit to have a bit more effectiveness. There we go. I'm gonna add some cinematic drum. That sounds sick, okay. It's 10.53, I have seven minutes to finish this stream. I need a little white noise up here. Now we gotta do it. Do it right. Maybe like a little clap too. Maybe like a hi-hat actually. Yeah. That sounds so cool. <laughs> I'm copy pasting that on the entire thing because that's just so friggin' awesome. Now first what we gotta do is get the uh, just over 12 seconds. Bit of reverb, we gotta change this to free mode so we can have a riser. It needs to be 12-ish seconds. That should be okay. Maybe we go down an octave. And now I'm just, I don't have time to do anything else. I'm gonna copy that, paste it here. We're just gonna do a few different, and I'm gonna change the bass wave from a pulse to a saw, and I'm gonna change that to a reverse mod. Boom, let's try that. Oh, that's actually pretty good. All right, it's 11.01, I'm supposed to be gone. 
but we're gonna listen to it real quick. This is the song that I made out of bike parts. It sounds awful, but it was fun. It was fun filming it. So 